Robert Kirkman's been talking a little bit. Um, Good old Kirkman. It's nothing interesting. I don't, I don't want to dwell on it too much, but he's... How, how long have we been... Is Walking Dead been going now? Like 130? No. Yeah, we're past that, like... Are we? We must be. It. Are we? Uh, 137? No, because 100 was obviously a thing. And then, oh, wait, no, we might be because of the... Have we all got to 150 war. yet? Like, I thought we no, were No, we're not 100, 100. definitely not 150. All right, so, anyway, a fucking long old while. And I think... The thing about Kirkman is he never fucking finishes a book, just... I don't know if he just doesn't know <laughs> well, how to end the story. Book. I've talked about this before with other people, because you just think... Oh, how does this story end? Like, how many years am I going to have to read this fucking thing? Where's the ending? Oh, crap, we are past the history of 150. Yeah, I thought we were. Fuck. 159? I'm, I'm behind. Yeah. So, he's always said, I've got an ending in mind for the for the comic. And he's come out and said, and I think it was one of those Kevin Smith podcasts or shows or whatever. He's come out and said, um, it's going to be a different ending that the TV show has to the one I've got in mind for the comic because the comic book will still be going probably when the TV show ends and I just, oh, fuck's oh, sake no. can you just can you just fucking work towards a conclusion on this book please there's only so <laughs> much I can read I'm, I'm bored of this whisperer's crap it's so long I really don't like, think he knows how to do an ending he doesn't he's still Fucking around with Negan right now. It's ridiculous. Um, the the idea. I mean, this TV show could go on for another four or five years or whatever. And they said season twelve, didn't they? I don't know. They've got to, or they've either they've either ended at season twelve or they've planned to season twelve or something. There's something about season twelve. I'm pretty sure I read. The other thing he did recently that was confusing was he he always said that Invincible is a superhero book that he would like to see other people continue writing after he leaves. But he's ending it, and he's fucking ending that one. So we'll see. We'll see if he knows <laughs> Which, how to end uh, the book with that one. I, I, Dave Wyatt just started reading Invincible. Um, good old Invincible's Dave massive. I know. I read like the free first issue, I think, on Comicsology, and thought, oh yeah, I'm quite into this. And then opened up exactly how much there was to read. Oh, God. Yeah. And I, I need to take, like, six months sabbatical from work, I think, to get through that stuff. They're in the, in the kind of early hundreds. Um, they're well past issue 100, because I got that issue a couple of years ago. Um, but they're not, they're not as fast as Charlie Adler drawing, so um, they're, not, they're not up to date with... You know, they're not at the same sort of numbers as Walking Dead, but no. we'll see how they end it. All right. <sighs> He ends up in the Walking Dead universe. I didn't think he had an ending in mind, but now he's changed his fucking. Oh, Kirkman. I hope you, it's you not are... just a. I'm rushing to an ending on it. He's an interesting writer, but I don't think. Like I have a lot of respect for the guy. I have a lot of respect for the guy, but yeah. the Walking Dead's like the comics just dragging on for me at this point. Yeah, me too. 